Okay, so this song is actually really easy to play. You only need to learn two small parts. I'm going to teach all of them to you right now. First of all, I want you to have a look above the piano at the chords. We've got G minor, D sharp, and then D7 twice. And if you don't know what that means, that's absolutely fine. Just sit tight. I'm going to explain to you all of the stuff you need to learn. So, first of all, the whole idea of these chords is that we get this sound. Okay, and because the D7 chord is displayed twice, we have to play that twice as long. Okay, so we could say one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. Okay, that is basically the chorus already. Now we want to make it sound a little bit more Latin. So you cannot just play. Something like that, okay? So we have to do something about that. But first of all, let's have a look at the left hand. We're going to play G and D, and then E flat, B flat, and E flat, and then D, A, and D. Okay, these are the notes we're working with. Okay, and the thing we want to play is this. That kind of thing, okay? So you get a bit of that Latin feel, but we're not necessarily playing that in the left hand. So, just remember, G and D, E flat, B flat, E flat, and then D, A, D. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna put a little bit of that melody line in the right hand. Right is playing those chords. G, B flat, and D for G minor. G, B flat, E flat for E flat. And then F sharp, A, and D for D. Okay, so from here to here. Like that, okay? What I like to do is I like to give it that little sound in the end. Okay, so for this chord, I play F sharp A D. I'm playing a regular D chord, basically. I'm not playing that C in there yet. Um, F sharp A D, and then the other one, I just play F sharp and A. So the sound will be like this. Okay, and... Like that. And you get that little bit of a Latin sound. So, for left... Simply play a G, E flat, and then a D if you want to make it easy for yourself, or you can play octaves, or you can play those notes that I showed you before. G and D, E flat, B flat, E flat, and D and D. Okay? So, to combine it, let's just start by playing everything together. So here, like that, and... Okay, so now I want to play it one at a time. So left, right, left, and then left, right, right, and then left. Okay, which is very confusing for some reason. But pay attention. Left, right, left, left, right, right, left, and then right. Okay, so we have eight things. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And you get this feeling for this song, okay? So let me do that slowly a couple of times. Okay, and basically I'm waiting here. That's that second D right here. I'm waiting a little bit in this area to start again. So right here. I'm basically waiting. until it can start again, okay? So I hope that makes sense. Let's do it one more time. And if that's too hard for you, don't worry, okay? We're all learning here. So if it's too hard, you can just play the chords. That's also cool. Remember to go from this D and then to the A so you get. So the sound will be this. Or here. Okay, and you hear that? It's kind of the same. So depending on if you're able to do that or not, play the chords like that or like that. OK? 
Okay, and then we're moving on. So now what we're doing is we're playing E flat and then the D and then G minor for two times. Okay, the chords are the same. The chords are the same. <laughs> but the order has changed, okay? So an E flat octave in the left hand, D octave, and a G octave. And the right hand is playing G, B flat, E flat, F sharp, A, D, and then uh, G, B flat, D, okay? So, right there. Play the second chord twice as long. Okay, and after that, you're simply going back to Okay, so basically we're playing this. And then moving to. Okay, that little bit. I'll let's do once more. So let's say this was the end, then you're simply gonna. Continue on right there, okay? So you move from the first pattern that we did to the second one and then back to the first to finish up the entire song. And that is the entire song. Now make sure to have a look in the description box down below. I'm playing through the entire song right there in the, in the instrumental version of Havana by Camila Cabello. See you right there. Hi, 